am the People First team lead, uh, real estate agent. If you want to be fancy, you can say I'm a realtor. I am not a broker, but that is in the works. I have a business degree and four beautiful daughters that range between the ages of 24 and 10. I have had many different careers, I guess, different paths in my life. I have had a cosmetology license, an uh, alcohol distribution license, and now I hold a real estate license. Um, I have liked, loved, and hated a lot of different aspects of the jobs that I've had. I've tried many different things, and I could just honestly never fit into any one particular thing. I would be almost in any job, you know, good at something and not so great at something else. I just never felt like I truly fit into whatever that I was doing. I wanted to be able to say that I was like a nurse or a teacher or something that was very specific, just something that could you could put in a little box and put a bow on it. But I just could never find the right place for myself. After I finished business school and I went into the corporate world, I quickly realized that the corporate world and my ethics did not align very well. Um, it didn't matter how hard you work, how hard I work. It was just without our values aligning, it's very difficult to move up in that world. I really wanted to make a difference in the world and that wasn't going to be it. So I got a, an opportunity that fell into my lap and I really felt that that was going to be it. I was going to be working with kids with disabilities and the nurses that took care of them at home. Turns out uh, that job made me realize that I was not as detailed oriented or as detailed uh, or as organized as I thought I was. And that position did not work out for me. I felt like I had failed and that there was just no way of coming back from that. So I was gonna take another path and decided to go back for my master's. But while I was working on that, um, I actually had a friend of mine that suggested real estate and I had considered it in the past and since I wasn't doing a whole lot other than going to school I actually started school for real estate right away it felt very comfortable and very natural and as the time went by once I got licensed um, it just felt like everything fell into place everything that I had learned all the tools I had gained in different uh, careers just genuinely fell into place within my real estate world. I remember people talking about how much they love their jobs and I used to, I could never identify with that. I used to think, oh, nobody really loves their job. Uh, that's just something people say to make themselves feel better. But today I can genuinely tell you that I love what I do. It doesn't even seem like a job. It's a career it's a form of serving my community and my clients I'm so grateful for all the time that I've had and the people that I have met I finally feel like I fit into a world a community a place of my own I've learned a lot of lessons I've learned that there's some paths you have to do and take on your own and I learned that there's whenever you have a community there's a lot of things you don't have to do on your own so I am very grateful for that some of my best friends and um, I've made through my work and for that I couldn't change it for anything else. The other aspect is that I still believe in the American dream and if I can help anyone else reach the American dream of owning their own home and being independent of a landlord, I would do everything I can to help you. I'm here for any questions you may have but if you ever wonder why people do what they do now you know why I do what I do. If you ever have any questions or you need anything from me, I'm here for you. Thank you so much for your time and for spending a few minutes with me. This is Gloria Miller with People First Realty Group. You guys have a great one.